Okay, Tereches. We are continuing with Tereches. Ah. Okay, say that, you know, for the video. So after we have explained, we have the Siman Ches. So after we explained that the that, that Tzamad was, was, was Mekusha to, to, to the Tzadik, he receives life and vitality from the Tzadik. And the Rishon, they receive life and vitality from the, 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 the Klippah. And he says that you have to defeat the Rishon that received the Ruach from the Klippah. And the only somebody who totally defeated and separated the bad within him can do this because once you go into their lair, if you have anything, any shaykhs with them, they're going to capture you. And the way that a person separates the bad from the good in his own body, you know, in, 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 in physically, is by learning Allah and discerning what the Allah should be. Once you do this, once you discern what the Allah should be, the, the bad and good is separated. The bad and good have a chizah in the Torah. So when you learn Torah, you find, okay, what is good and what is bad, what I should do, what I should not do, then the bad is separated at its very, very root. The bad and the good yeah. are separated on a very spiritual realm. And that spiritual realm is the Isis of Torah. And when they're separated, then within the very element, elemental level of the body, the very building blocks of the body, the bad and the good are also separated. Then the bad is discarded and the good is elevated. And, and now the Rebbe explains, and we started learning a little bit about before, that this is the beginning of, of, of Arba Tzitzis, the four Tzitzis. But the four Tzitzis, we're holding it a bit, a bit weiter. Anyhow, I'm just... just Recapping. Re, 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 whatever, what you said. The Rebbe says, we gives life to the world, that they can get it from the, from the Torah, and they are giving it over to those that are connected to them. At this, Kodesh Baruch Hu told Yechezkel that he should say to the, to the, to the, to the dry bones, Koma Hashem Baruch Hu Ruach, from the four corners of the earth, let, you know, let the, 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 the Ruach come and, and lift, you know, give life to, to, to the corpses. So you see that the Ruach Chaim that is going to resurrect the dead, it comes from a Bechina, which is called Arba Ruchais, four, four corners, four, four, four spirits. This is the Bechina of Tzitzis that has four corners, which is the four letters of the Shem Avaya that are the, the tubes that, the, the, through which the pipeline, through which comes the Ruach Chaim to the, to the Four elements of the so Shall the day that the tzitzis you machnia the ruach sorrow, you defeat the ruach sorrow. Shuach shuach ruach shal misnagdim. That's the spirit of the misnagdim. That's the alam. That's the 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 panash. That's the you know the bravura of uh, you know once this is lost, even though if you take a look at 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 uh, battles are fought on that. Wars are for, are for um, hope. When there's no hope, you know, Napoleon Bonaparte, he said that the, the moral to the physical in warfare mm -hmm. is three to one. You know, the, 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 what the moral is like, it's yeah. three times more important than the physical. Because if you already think that you lost, you lost already. So this, 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 this defeats the Ruch of the Misnagdim and the Cholkim and the Tzadikim Amitim, that the dispute, the true Tzadikim, that which, which would, who, 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 who bring about the Ruch Chaim, the, the Rav the Klippa, the Rishonim are getting their own spirit, their own this from the Rav the Klippa, which is the first Ace of Ish Sawyer. Ace of Ish Sawyer is, is Ace of, uh, 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 is a hairy man, is the answer for the 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 tzaddik dusha from from the opposite side, his ruach is ruach saara. His ruach is, is a storm wind. That's why tzitzis is l'shon se'ah. You know, tzitzis is is is, is you know is 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 a uh, uh, own of of heavy. As it is said, in Yecheskel, they kacheni be tzitzis roishim. 
and he took me in the tzitzis of my head. So here the tzitzis and hair is one thing. This defeats Esau, who is a hairy, who is a hairy man. And, and the more the tzaddikim uh, increase the Ruach HaKadusha in the world, this, the, commensurately, this defeats the Ruach this is the white talus that Kodesh Baruch Hu has wrapped himself with. And, and, and he counted out the 13 rectifications of the, of, of, of the Midas. That as long that, that any time that Am Yisrael are, are, are sinning, they'll do this Seder of the Shlosh Midas and he will atone for them. As Chazal said, must ask Moshe Shalom. Why? Because those thirteen traits of Rachamim, of compassion, and Pchinas Aruach Chaim de Kedusha. This is the source of the Ruach Chaim of holiness. As it is said before, we said before in Os Dalad that the thirteen Midos of Rachamim they bring upon us the Ruach Chaim to fulfill everything that we lack, and to atone for our variance. And this constitutes a talus. This is four, four, four sides. This is the, the roof that comes from that source, which is called the four winds. That's why the Kodesh Baruch the imagery, is a Kodesh Baruch wrapping himself in the talus. And his mashpia, the 13 minas of Rachamim, in other words, that's a Kodesh Baruch Hu, Daf Karat himself, Kiviochel, the imagery is Talis Slovan, is a white Talis, because it's Hefech, Pchinas Loch, and the Klippa. It's exactly the opposite of all the Klippa. Pchinas Esau, which, uh, which when he was born, he says, Moini Kulok he's red, totally like a, like, like a hairy garment. And Rashi says, What is Kader Sar? Ketalis, like a Talis. Like he was wearing a red talus. Talus like a dafka. The word talus that Rashi uses is very, very precise. Because talus the klipa, the talus the klusha, the talus the klipa. So we have talus other. That's a red talus. Shemisha nimsha charuach shel arishoyim kanal. That's the the source of the spirit of all the arishoyim. As opposing the talus the klusha from which come the ruach chaim, the klipa also have a talus. From where they come, Ruach Saor, the storm wind, Ruach the Tov. And then Talas the Gdusho, by using Talas the Gdusho, which is Talas Lava and Machni Moisoy. You defeat it. We'll stop here and we'll continue in the session.